Hey, Steve Basic Architect. Yeah, so we're out here at the church of Santa Maria del Fiore, the Domo, in Florence. That's the front door. How gorgeous is that? Look at the scale of that to the people. So, yeah, 20, I don't know, those are probably 20, 22 foot doors. But I'm going to do a pan around. You can see, look at this is the line. My wife is gracious enough to uh, be standing in that line and I'll catch up with her in a little bit but it goes down around the corner a ways so obviously one of the highlights of uh, Italy but uh, we'll start here in the center section Let's zoom out a little just getting focused here so so this is the center section of the church and when I say visually overwhelming i think that's a huge understatement there's just statues little nooks coves sculptures the big rosette window there just absolutely gorgeous and again when you look at these, you have to put yourself in the frame of mind that the people walking up to this building, 1300, 1400 AD, this is absolutely incredible structure. This is the left side. So you can see it's just a kind of mini version of the center and it has the same rosette there. And then if we pan across, there is a twin on the right side here. What you're seeing on the far right there is, that is the bell tower. It's actually separated physically from the church. Just looks like it's sitting right next to it there. But, um, yeah, just absolutely incredible. Let's take a walk closer here and uh, we'll try and pick up on some of the detail here at the front door so there's the front door and you can see the sculptures on each side in their own little niche that I, I can't even fathom a guess on how long it took to uh, sculpt that and put it together. But the doors, and then of course the painting. You know, the way sculpture and craftsmanship and painting and art is put together here, it's uh, absolutely gorgeous. And then you can see here, even going up these columns, right? You have these kind of twisty stairs going up each side. And then just above that frieze, there are a couple more statues carved with little hoods above them. And then above that, we have yet another statue. And then above that, we have kind of the linear row of statues with the most important one. And notice that the triangle to the doorway is literally pointing right at it. And then of course, the rosette window and the top of the wall. Sorry, believe it or not, my arm is getting quite tired. love these doors. Absolutely love those doors. And uh, I'm just taking a quick look to see if they are symmetrical. They, uh, they appear to be very, very close. They're not exact, but there is uh, 
let's just say they're very, very similar, but they aren't perfectly book matched. So. And, uh, even the smaller doors over here. Yeah, it's a European ambulance going by. You see those doors and all the uh, craftsmanship. It's, uh, it's incredible. Incredible. And to think, you know, they were putting this together in the 13th century. So I can only imagine the, the site discussions that were had to create that. It's, it's mind boggling. So, all right, well, I'm gonna go find my wife and uh, get in line and uh, I'll see you inside.